Now, Chief Meteorologist Scott Dorval with the On Your Side forecast. Keeping a close eye on a very changeable weather pattern. In fact, changes going on in Boise right now. Temperature dropping 10 degrees as a rain cooled air mass is sliding in from a shower just east of town. Tomorrow, more showers are going to approach. Our weather will come from the west tomorrow. That's where you want to look out. And by three, two, three o'clock in the afternoon, we'll see them approaching Ada County earlier in the Western Valley. Eastern Oregon can get them by midday and they'll slide across the valley. Another wave could come through during the evening. Won't rain all day, but it'll be enough to get the ground wet off and on and off and on on Saturday, Sunday and Monday precipitation. We may peak up near 70 and then cooling as rain falls. It's not until after the long weekend that we have drier conditions warming up to near 80 possible by this time next week. 74 degrees for the high temperatures normal. We'd be in the 60s tomorrow. Wind speeds should be fairly light during tomorrow. There may be some gusty breezes around showers and storms that might pop up. Uh, the cloud cover will be favoring the afternoon hours as we see here. A chance of some sunshine as the sun comes up. Could be a pretty nice morning. Maybe get out to mow the grass. Probability of precipitation favoring the afternoon. This is when the best chance of getting uh, some showers later in the day. Updating this now. You see it kind of ramping up from noon peaking at 3 o'clock and then we might get another peak here closer to 8 o'clock as another wave moves through. So late day showers and a chance for some storms popping up. So my recreation forecast Green, yellow, red, well, lots of yellow showing up because we'll have some times where the weather will be decent over the weekend, but it's not going to be a sunny weekend with a temperature of 80 degrees. It's just not going to happen. We're going to have some rain, and when it's raining, it can be very, very chilly, especially in the mountains. It will be cold rain coming down, and then at times the sun will come out, and you'll think, boy, this is, it's nice, and then it will change again. So some red showing up. I know the pools are opening this weekend. might not be the best weekend for it. Do keep an eye to the sky tomorrow because lightning is possible. I know the pools open tomorrow afternoon. Watch out if there's lightning. Of course, uh, pool operators will get people out of the water if that a storm happens to pass next to one of those pools. So here are the showers. One just east of Boise here heading down uh, Highway uh, uh, Interstate 84. This little line you see right here pushing to the west. That's that cool air mass just pushing the flying, just passing east of the uh, west of the flying Y moving east to west right now. So as rain comes down here, it's sending out a cool wave of air that will make it probably to Meridian in about 40 minutes or so. It might not be as strong, but it's been a 10 to 12 degree temperature drop. So from 71 or two down to 60 at Simcoe Road, and that's likely happening in downtown Boise. You see the circulation around this low pressure, right? This is the one that was to our west. They went to Vegas and for a vacation and pushing back up now to the north here. Dry air is trying to work its way in, but the problem is there's a couple more low pressures dropping right on end from Alaska here. This one will drop down to the south, then weaken and come and end uh, to basically die out over central Oregon, central Idaho, I should say, on Saturday. The next system will be a little stronger. It will go right down the coast and that will keep moisture pinwheeling in our direction as we head into the weekend. So here you see that kind of this, the animation of it. Here's our low pressure sending some showers tomorrow afternoon in. The low itself goes right over Idaho. Now when that happens on Saturday, we have morning rain. Some Sometimes there's no rain in the middle where the low is, but rain wrapping around it. So it's tough to tell where it will be raining on Sunday and when. And then you see later on Sunday moisture coming in from our last storm system that's diving to the south, and that could pinwheel more storms up. We might get a break and get Monday to dry out, just be a chance of some storms. But the latest charts, this keeps changing constantly, now showing a chance for close to a half inch of rain for Ada County. So all over the map with the precipitation, the bottom line is often on rain, Sunshine trying to mix in from time to time, or at least dry weather at any point during the weekend, but a chance for rain right through the weekend for the mountains. This is the McCall area only in the 50s with a good chance of some showers coming in. My exclusive true view of tomorrow's weather today. You'll see it here. We may get into the upper 60s, but in the afternoon, rain cooled air will come on in. The temperature will plummet as the showers move on in. If you've got a ball game planned tomorrow evening, you may get washed out again as that cool air comes in with the rain later in the day. Rain showers are likely with isolated storms and the Boise and West Central Mountains as the day progresses. Could be some heavy downpours towards the evening hours. And Staley and Sun Valley, it may start out with some sunshine, but then quickly clouding up. Rain coming in, snow level. Snow level 85 feet. Temperatures in the 50s in the Magic Valley tomorrow. Highs in the mid 60s with a chance for showers and maybe some thunderstorms later in the day. My extended forecast, Don, it's just really hard to pinpoint when it's going to rain, except tomorrow I see the favoring the afternoon. And then it's just... Uh, Back and there's forth just, over the weekend. There's just so much happening. It's hard to...
exactly. Oh, spinning here and here. <laughs> and here. <laughs> His lows going this way, and then which way are they moving, and then where are they throwing moisture at us from? So weather's been coming from every direction. Yeah. It's been coming from the east yesterday, north today. It'll come from the west tomorrow. I wish that low would have stayed in Vegas. If it stayed in Vegas, you know, for the weekend, yeah. we might have been okay. I ran out of cash. That happens. It happens to everybody. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Scott.